up guys Adrian here I am Draw TV we're back again I haven't posted in a while been busy planning stuff um, stressing it's very stressful trying to plan stuff with Covid going on you don't know what's gonna happen where you're gonna have to rush back to <laughs> like in middle of the night but um, you know I'm gonna be more consistent as I have to quarantine for 10 days um, just came back from Portugal if you don't follow me on uh, Instagram check that out um, I need to do a highlight of that actually. Mm. I need to put a highlight of um, that portal trip. It was amazing. Visited the Benegal Caves. Uh, you'll probably see the vlog real soon when I edit that. But uh, yeah, I have a special guest with us today. Introduce yourself, sir. I am Sir Spitfire, <laughs> otherwise known as Jay, and Mug Shops Photography. So you got, you got the merch there. Where did you, you get that done? My cousin actually has a quick plug. My cousin actually um, does my merch for me. So, what? and yeah, he's, he's local. So, stuff. he's got this. I've got the hat in the bag as well. Got the jacket. So, fully fully kitted out. Yeah, I need to get some stuff you done. Do, I definitely. need to get some stuff I'm, done. Nah, you decide, <laughs> up. Don't worry. Don't worry. But, uh, yeah, we've got a, got a topic probably seen in the title. Um, I saw it on, who did I see it on? I saw it on Niall's page, NSW, NSW. Photography. Mm. He's on my last vlog. Uh, yeah, literally my last vlog. Uh, check that out as well. Um, topic is: um, Should photographers uh, know how to pose models? But yeah, I want you to guys to put your opinions of if, if you think uh, a photographer should know how to pose models um, in the comment section below. Before I watch this, say pause it and put your opinion down below before we give our opinions. So uh, it's an unbiased opinion. So yeah, pause it. Let us know what you think. But yeah, what do you? What do you? Off the just from that, what do you think? Before I would have said no straight away, we shouldn't. Because if I hire a carpenter, I don't expect to stand over him and tell him how to make that table exactly. or chair or bench. <laughs> I want him to come, exactly. do the job, and it just yeah. makes my job easier. Because I'd be worried if I had to go tell a plumber what to do. Right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're a model and you don't know how to pose. Are you a model? But that is going to bring me on to why I'm like, mm, maybe we should. Um, Sometimes we're shooting with girls who say they're models, but they're not models, they're just Instagram girls. Instagram girls. So some of them are just pretty girls who have taken some pictures. Some people say you should be a model, next thing you know, she's a model. Got a few and that's the, exactly, that's the thing as well. If you're this day and age, it's like there, there's, it's kind of blurry lines between models and Instagram girls because if you're just a pretty girl, you might work at Tesco's. <laughs> you might work at America, you might work at Walmart. Yeah. You just might be a very pretty girl and yeah. then just automatically just gain a following. Right. And then all of a sudden someone told you you need to model and then you can just change your bio. It says now it says That's fashion my... model. <laughs> yeah. And then you've got the photographers influencer. hitting you up, you go to shoots and you don't, you literally can't, can't model. So yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, it's that thing where it's at before where, well, when we are growing up, mm -hmm. to say you're a model, you had to go through a modeling agency yes, that you had yes, to know yes. you had to like have like a literally an X Factor panel yes. and you had to walk or pose and they could tell you if you can and can't model. If you couldn't, you're not a model. You're not a model. <laughs> you still know that you weren't getting in there. No, not for Nowadays me. it's Instagram, so that's where it kinda of blurs the lines and me personally I'd rather shoot with to have the same three girls on my page over and over again who can actually model than fifty to a hundred girls who can't model are okay yeah just for the sake of having diversity on my page i'd rather quality than quantity yeah any realistically we all photographers are watching this I, I assume you could probably get loads of girls to shoot all the time it's just the quality of them yeah so again goes back to the quality of model that you're getting so if you're not saying that all of them can't model or can't pose there's a lot but there, there, there are a lot <laughs> <laughs> there are a lot um Anything that you want to do, if you're going to go and say you're, uh, you, you can drive, you have to do the test. Yeah. You know, so you have to practice. A number of these people are not practicing. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. my way of getting around posing them is before we shoot, I try to send them YouTube, uh, Pinterest, um, different mood boards that I've seen with people posing, with women, uh, the majority of women mm -hmm. I shoot, so with women doing different poses, mm -hmm. that helps. Send it to them in advance, ask them to practice it so that on the day, we're not spending an hour out of your two hour session or two hours out of your four hour session working on poses. We can mm. just get there and we can start after five, 10 minutes. You get comfortable, yeah. you practice with the poses and then we can go forward. But you have to, I think as a model, you should have at least two, three, four poses that your go-to poses. Mm -hmm. 
and I'm not saying the standard Instagram. What's the one now like that with the yeah. base brush of the hair? <laughs> the, 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 the pulling the eyes back the one. Eyes back oh one. my goodness! You know you should. Whole room. Oh, no, no, you should no. have different poses. Know how to arch your back. You know, go on your tiptoes. Come with something rather than yeah. just standing there thinking I'm going to stand here, looking pretty, and get my pictures taken. No, that 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 doesn't happen. Yeah, it makes a lot of difference uh, when you know how to pose and you come prepared. So, mm. so should you? No, we shouldn't have to, but more of us, I think, are having to now yeah. as photographers. And, but that's the th that's the thing, though. It's just like if we, us as a photography community kind of had the solidarity and goes, look, we're not going to. So it would force <laughs> <laughs> models <laughs> to model. <laughs> model yeah. or if you're not a model, then don't call yourself one because it's like how many shoots I've gone on to. And they're just standing there, like, okay, what should I do? I'm like, like, <laughs> your bio says what now? <laughs> you're in what agency? And you're asking that, you're asking me? Like, do you know what I mean? It's like, we're directing, that's a whole nother job role. Mm, mm. It's, it's literally a whole nother job. It's literally, we have directors on shoots. Yeah. For that reason. Yeah, yeah. And then there's a photographer well, who does it separately. Yes. With, do you know what I mean? Yes. So it's, yes. We're, we're, we're now taking on roles. Some of people like, some people like, uh, uh, posing uh, or yeah like directing to the T and know how to do that I personally want to focus on taking the picture because the, when I have the like I said when I uh, obviously on the channel my Instagram you see I shoot Chloe a lot she knows mm -hmm. how to model which makes my brain free yes. to now not have to worry about her so <laughs> I, I can worry about what I do and then it shows because those are my best those literally my best images yeah. my best videos because there's that I, I play off of it. Obviously, she do a, you can she does a pose. I'm like, okay, do that, but then put this up a bit more. Do you can play off of someone? Yeah. Which the, we have that great connection. But when it's just someone just like standing there, yeah. <laughs> it's like the vibe. It just kind of kills the flow. Do you know what I mean? That was going to bring me on to my point. Next point, um, the photographer. Uh, you said about photographers having somebody there do you think all the photographers that are shooting with these uh, models even know a pose themselves because a lot of people are mm. just picking up a camera taking shots I've seen mm. them on Instagram it's like mm. oh I'm going to become a photographer mm. they buy a Canon 70D put it in automatic shoot it <laughs> or maybe learn uh, you know uh, creative modes mm. they don't know a pose they don't know but if a model is posing see that's the thing though uh, okay there's that there's that but me personally terrible director like I know what I want to shoot like before going into it but when it comes to like individual posing yeah I, I, I personally I think I'm, I, I suck at it yeah so it's like but it's like I feel it's just something I shouldn't need to do I do I shouldn't need to know <laughs> I think we should, you should have with YouTube with YouTube with Instagram with mm. Pinterest even with TikTok it's out there you can, if mm. you want to learn these things, it's out there as a model. Mm. And if you're, you know, imagine turning up as a photographer saying, well, how do I use my camera? Exactly. You know, I'm like, oh, oh can, use what's this can, yeah, mean? Can, can you, Mrs. Model, can you <laughs> show me what I'm supposed to do? It's not going to work exactly. out, is it? Exactly. So, you know, you go, you find your resources online or yeah. you read about it in books, you talk to people, you speak to people in the community. Mm. Um, even if you're signed with an agency, a small mm. one, maybe just suggest to them that they give you some tips on how to model. Mm. I, I Like I said, I do it. I will send them the pictures that I have. This yeah. is the poses that we're going to go through. This is the look we're going to go yeah. go for. It's not just about, I'm just taking the camera, click, yet, yeah, turn, mm. move, no. So, do I, I would hope they could start learning some poses. Mm -hmm. We, no, I'm going to stick with, we shouldn't have to. No. We shouldn't <laughs> have to. No. I don't think, I, I personally don't, because Mod model is literally it's a descriptive word. <laughs> it's, it's, <laughs> like it's in you, the name. Like, it's in the name. Like <laughs> modeling something. You, yes. You're a model. Yeah. So, you know, to, to me, I, 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 and there was there was an advert. I don't know why they on YouTube where there was another photographer. I completely forgot the photographer's name, but she said the same thing. Like she doesn't agree with uh, the photographer knowing. Oh yes, I know the older yeah, lady. Yeah, the older lady. Yeah, all over, yeah, yeah, all yeah, over yeah. that and the adverts and stuff. Like yes. that. And I completely completely agree with that you, you shouldn't if you look at the best models out there they know how to model that is, it's a you know I mean? it's a reoccurring thing like 
they know how to model. It's the difference <laughs> between a model and just an, an Instagram, Instagram person. Yeah. A person on Instagram. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. I definitely think that makes a difference. If you say you're a model, if you've got model in your bio, at least know some poses, because that's rule number one. Yeah. Or know how to walk, strut, whatever. But no, mm -hmm. that it shouldn't be the job of the photographer. Mm -hmm. It's becoming it. As people become more lazy. Maybe. Exactly. Um, but I feel like that's just uh, catering to those type of models. Yeah. Yeah. Because obviously it's now becoming a bigger thing. More people thinking that they're models. Um, yeah. I think that's because of that. And and because we've been locked up, so where I think things have had to change. Where mm -hmm. the your conventional model. Mm -hmm. who doesn't have the makeup artist, the stylist and so mm -hmm. on is taking the back seat at the moment while we were locked up for the mm -hmm. girl who knows how to take a nice selfie with mm -hmm. the online pose that they do yeah, yeah. Um, and she's now become a model for a, a, a brand a brand yeah, will see yeah. that and say oh send us more stuff she's not mm -hmm. a model mm -hmm. she knows how to pose herself with her mobile phone yeah. with a nice little camera that they send her but phone model a phone model <laughs> yeah, but it's become business and I suppose an iPhone -ographer. Yeah. <laughs> more that's new people with iPhones on it. I have an iPhone now and I take some good pictures. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> Android forever for me. <laughs> um so that's become the new normal. Almost you don't have to be able to pose uh, for for some of these brands and, and some of these um modeling agencies. They just want to know that you look good on the other side of the camera, no matter how you do it. Mm. So yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> I think it goes back to that. The, the, the quality of the model also dictates if they'll be able to model or not. So those more experienced, yes, I wouldn't expect someone like that to have to be posed. But if you're a newcomer, fresh out of the box, I can see if you come without knowing anything yeah. about knowing how to stand up, how to make yourself look taller or shorter, your your, mm. your best side. Mm. Mm. That's another thing, there's 99% don't the best side. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm like, what's your best side? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. You should. Like, if you don't know, how do I know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've only met you today. <laughs> I'm just seeing you right <laughs> now. There. This could be your, yeah. So again, if it's, photography is a lot of times time-based. Mm. If we're spending half an hour trying to say what side is, it just burns into your time. Mm. It burns into our shooting time. So. Let's, let's try and come prepared. It's all about being prepared, isn't it? Yeah. Readiness. So come prepared, know your poses. That way I don't have to show you. It makes for a much better shoot. It yeah. makes for a great shoot. Yeah, I mean, that's it guys. <laughs> what do you think? You know, uh, yeah, let us know in the comment section below. Uh, should photographers know how to poddle, uh, poddle? <laughs> Pose. <laughs> Pose models? Um, or do you think it's not our it's not our job because uh, it says photographer, not photographer, director, <laughs> model, poser. Um, but yeah, what do you think? Well, yeah, let us know. Uh, yeah, we'll catch you guys in the next one. <laughs>